Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Ruby. I finally gave Breloom a nickname. He's now Fungaroo. <laughs> I spent forever trying to come up with a nickname for him. Uh, that was the best thing that I could come up with. Half fungus, half kangaroo. Fungaroo. <laughs> Alright. Uh, actually... We're gonna use Fungaroo today. Because we're out in the ocean. Alright, so now we're gonna be making our way towards... Moss... Is it Moss Deep? City? City? Town? Moss Deep. So that's what we're gonna go with. You just float in the sea like this, Pokemon come around to play. Yeah, that don't work like that in real life. Jenny. Oh, this is a good one for Fungaroo. Uh, you probably just mock punch this thing. Ooh. I should really look up when I learn Sky Uppercut. Because uh, that, that'll that come in handy. Let's see if this knocks it out. Ooh, almost. Please don't confuse me. Thank you. Wilmer down! Oh, lost at sea. Just go that way. Battle me. Hmm, you're riding a Pokemon instead of swimming yourself. I am envious. Well, at least you don't have to, like, you know, learn surf. You can just go into the water. That would be really handy in a Pokemon game. But, you know. It would open up the entire world right away. Is he gonna have rough skin? Eh, nope. No rough skin. Ooh, I can't. Although I don't... Will rough skin work if it's not a physical move? I don't know how to dive yet, so I can't do that. Tinder cool. Alright. We don't want a tentacle. Ooh. Is there anything here? No. That was a waste of getting off. What is this? Oh, is this the guy that wants the shards? To get you can get the stones from him? I'm the diving treasure hunter. I'm the awesome dude who makes deep sea dives to gather treasure. Resting at the bottom. You haven't got any treasures for me. If you see any shards like the red shard, you've got to trade it with me. Yep, so if you trade him shards, he gives you stones. Yeah. Firestone, Thunderstone, and Waterstone. Leaf Stone, too. I forgot about the Leaf Stone. <laughs> uh, let's keep going this way, I guess. Oh, there's Moss Deep. I was looking for... There's a cave up here somewhere, but I can't remember. I don't think I passed it yet. I should be able to fly to Moss Deep now, too. Go away, Tentacle. 125. There we go. Double battle. Uh, this should be good. A funny old man lives in the Shoal Cave, someone told me. Are you going to see him too? And why not? Swablu and Nummel. Huh. Alright, get rid of the Nummel. And then focus on Swap. Uh, I'll try this. 
Please flinch. Yeah. Oh. Yes. Double flinch. Perfect. One down. This one's not gonna faint from this though. Come on, flinch. Yes. The luck already. Well, that was a really easy battle. Good job, Fungaroo and Poochie. I don't know why I said Poochie weird there. Poochie. <laughs> I thought we would win. I thought you would at least get a hit in. Uh, are there any interesting Pokemon here? I think you can get a Spiel here. Uh, are you planning on going deep in there? How about bringing me back some soul salt and soul shells? I can make you something good if you bring me the ingredients. But you're not telling... How am I supposed to know how much you need? Well, that was a waste of time. Zubat! Should I just catch a Zubat already? At this thing, okay, I was gonna say if it survived, then I would try to catch it. Level up! get the level 26 and I'm not get, getting a 13. <gasps> oh, if I didn't have a water type, I would totally use this thing. Will you survive a headbutt? You do. And you flinched. Perfect. Now get in the ball. Well, I got what I came here for. <laughs> A Pokemon I might- The Clap Popa? <laughs> oh my god, it's the Clap Pokemon. This feel is much faster rolling than walking to get around. When groups of this Pokemon eat, they all clap at once to show their pleasure. Because of this, their meat meal times are noisy. Well, if you guys got a nickname for Sfeel, let me know down in the comment section. Uh, I don't think there's anything in this cave other than its feels. Oh, of course, this one's way stronger. Uh, yeah, let's just go. If people want me to explore this place, then let me know, and I'll I'll consider it. But uh, we're gonna head back towards Moss Deep. Hi, little kitty cat. My cat just came to say hi. I don't know if you can hear that. Uh, come on. I really should use the repel. Ooh. Level 30. Will you survive a headbutt? You will. Okay. Let's try to get a Zubat. I think this thing evolves in like the early 20s. So. And then to get a Crobat, I think it's like a uh, friendship to get to Crobat. Uh, I'm gonna call you Zuzu. Zuzu. There you go. You don't get the nickname, that one. <laughs> no! Alright, we're gonna get out of this cave, and in the next episode, we're gonna... We're gonna check out Moss Deep. Let's actually uh, get to the the town now 
before the end of the video. Hopefully I don't have to surf anymore, but probably will have to. Any items lying around? Hello. I heard from my mates in Lilico that the herd of Whalmer has disappeared. What went down over there, I wonder? Okay. All life needs to see to live, even though it makes it home on the land. Life, having run its course, becomes soil and returns to the land, and the sea is always connected to the land. Yes, like the very shoreline here. Ooh. We got another netball. I'm getting a few of those lately. Well, anyway, since we're here in town, the next gym is here, so maybe we'll do that in the next episode. So, if you guys enjoyed this episode, leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe, and in the next episode, we're going to be taking on the gym. So until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.